Coast to Coast, direct from Austin. You're listening to the Alex Jones Broadcasting Network. Network. Big Brother. Mainstream media. Government cover-ups. You want answers? Well, so does he. He's Alex Jones on the GCN Radio Network. And now, live from Austin, Texas, Alex Jones. We're in overdrive. Tom, at one more point from New York. Go ahead, brother. Yeah, this is a different subject, but, um, yeah, back, uh, I know you listen to a lot of heavy metal or you have it in your intros and stuff like that. My question is, is back in the 80s, like, when, uh, Tipper Gore and all her little goony friends were trying to create the Parents for Rating Music Commission. Do you think they were actually demonizing heavy metal because it was a political statement and they were trying to wake people up about the repression that was going on? Well, yeah, well, they wanted to ignore all the real bad stuff going on in media and act like they were doing something good, putting parental labeling on things that only, in most cases, increase the sales 10 times. Uh, but uh, again, most of the stuff I like, I mean, if you look at something like Megadeth, it's not satanic, it's anti-tyranny. Or if you look at something like Billy Corrigan, you know, it, it's kind of a media thing. There is obviously satanic music out there all over the place and we criticize it. I, I just play a lot of it because I like it and it's high energy. And that's why Michael Savage plays it. So it really comes down to that. Thank you, Tom. Uh, but yeah, and the Tipper Gore stuff, that was all just grandstanding to manipulate uh, the social right to vote Democrat by Tipper Gore. Uh, let's talk to Jill in California. You're on the air. Go ahead. Oh, hi, Alex. Um, I'm just floored by that Dr. Uh, Rocky's uh, testimony about the all that um, his, the radiation and his experience is just awful. I was going to talk about the Second Amendment, but <laughs> that just really got to me. And the thing is, it's just ongoing. And it's like, what's wrong with the establishment? It's not just like they don't care stuff's leaking and having problems. They're expanding it all. Yeah, and um, I had a, I don't know if you know of Ken Rolla. He's a, um, an engineer and a health expert. He specializes in radiation mitigation. No, I haven't heard of him. Well, you can Google him. His last name's Rolla, R O A. -T -L -A. Okay, well, what's he saying? Um, well, he instructs people how to build their own devices and how to uh, do soil mitigation when you're growing your garden. Um, he, he, you can structure your water. You can structure your soil. Interesting. I'll, 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 I'll look into it, Jill. I'm going to jump to the next person. Thank you. Lee in Iowa. Lee, you're on the air. Go ahead. Hello. Um, I'd love to talk about uh, the situation in Ukraine. Yeah, go ahead. You're um, on air. Thank you concur with the caller earlier that had uh, spoken to several people in uh, Ukraine. My wife is Ukrainian, actually, uh, from Kiev. Lucky man. In Kiev. <laughs> and, oh yeah, she's something. Um, the people there are just wonderful, and I can tell you... Yeah, it's not just they're good-looking women. I, I hear they're just really real women. Oh, very, very much feminine. Um, but I can tell you at this point, no matter how this uh, revolution started, I can tell you the people who live there are very much for liberty in Ukraine. They know Russia is sticking its fingers into this. Oh, you there's know, no doubt Russia and the West are doing it. And the West. But I think at this point, the, the average man is completely fed up with the Ukrainian government. The corruption there runs very deep. It, it carries over from the Soviet era. You know, if you want anything done, you got to pay a bureaucrat to do something. And the deputies and the ministers, you know, they live very good lives because they get all the money skimmed off. And I just, at this point, I don't see a peaceful end to it. Yanukovych and his party, they know if they give up, they're either going to prison or they're going to be executed, I think. And so all hell's going to break loose. Appreciate your call. Great points. Yeah, I'm sorry to Fred, Dave, and Paul. Uh, call me back tomorrow, Paul, Dave, and Fred, if you can get in. I'll put you to the head of the line. In fact, you can get their numbers if you want, John, to have them on tomorrow. Uh, Lord willing, we'll be back tomorrow with a Friday transmission. Please pray for this broadcast. A lot of good things are happening around here. A lot of bad things are happening in my life as well that I don't get into on air. And I appreciate everybody's support. Helps us continue through all the things that are happening and going on. And nobody said life was easy. It's a great animating challenge, though. When we all live these short lives that are just a burst of energy and a race to the end and then the next generation. When you really think about it, that is humanity, is that long arc 
that trajectory and I just don't want us to fail and blow the planet up. I want to succeed. I realize I'm my ancestors and my progeny are me. American gardeners and fellow patriots make the right choice with your money, time, and your family food supply. Choose 100% pure heirloom seeds in the Survival Seed Vault from MyPatriotSupply.com. Why spend more? The Survival Seed Vault from MyPatriotSupply.com is only $37.95 and includes 20 varieties of pure.